Hello everyone, I'm Mariana Figuero. I'm a professor and director of the Light and Health Research Center at the Econ School of Medicine at Mount Sinai. In the past few years, we have been involved in a series of research projects looking at the impact of light on health and well-being. One of our current studies is looking at sleep and myocognitive impairment patients. Do you have trouble sleeping at night? Do you stay at home during the morning hours? Have you been diagnosed with mild cognitive impairment? You may be eligible to participate in one of our studies that it's looking at the optimum lighting conditions to help you sleep at night. We'd like to invite you or someone you know to participate in one of our studies. The total length of the study is nine months. And during six months, you'll be exposed to a special lighting that will be installed in your home. Prior to us installing the lights in your home, a nurse will come in the evening, will run some cognitive tests, will put a cap on you that it's measuring your sleep. You're gonna sleep with a cap on. The following day, she'll come back, she'll retrieve the cap, she'll run other cognitive tests on you. She'll also ask you to wear a couple of devices. One you're gonna wear on the wrist, and one you're gonna wear, wear as a pendant. And they're gonna be measuring your wrist activity as well as your light exposure. After one week, she'll come back and she'll install and turn on the lights in the room where you spend most of your day. The lights will be on for six months. We're coming back and repeating the assessments during those six months periods. At the end of six months, we'll turn off the lights We'll wait another five to eight weeks and we'll come back and we'll do a final assessment. You will get paid to participate in that study, $50 every time we come back to do an assessment for a total of $250. We hope you're able to participate because we think that light can be a very powerful non-pharmacological intervention that can improve your sleep, health, and well-being. Thank you very much.